Down here with Reedy, uh, nil nil Leicester Villa. Reedy, what can you say? Well, let's talk Dakar. Let's talk Dakar. I, I honestly thought Dakar had a, a good, decent game. I thought the runs he made, just just the angles he was making to make the runs was com compared to what you, you have been doing the last few games. I thought he changed. Oh, the <laughs> Shh, <don't you? laughs> honestly, honestly, thought he was he had a better game than he has, he has done anyway. He's been he's been a lot better recently. I think I honestly think Reedy, you're watching a different game to me. I thought Dakar was shocking again. No. I thought he's not involved. He doesn't he doesn't seem to play with any intelligence. Doesn't get near the ball. Doesn't doesn't just I, I don't know. Dakar doesn't seem to do anything for me. I Are you allowed to? You know? No, it, it, I, don't, I don't mean it. For me, okay, yeah, this this game alone is. I thought he did a lot better. Wise, he did a lot better going forward, making them runs. Yes, he didn't do the best still, but. No one really did the best that game. But you know, for me, I mean, when Vardy comes on on the 70th minute, I mean, Vardy didn't do a lot today, but I thought he got more involved. I wouldn't say that. I think, I think, I honestly thought Dakar had but more of a more of a go at it today. I don't, I, I'm having loads of things in front of my face saying I'm talking absolute shit, but no, I, I honestly think Dakar's probably better than Vardy today. It'd be interesting to see what people think about Dakar. I think it is worth a debate soon about him, but obviously we have different opinions. Um, what, what else about today? Yuri Tillemans? I've, I, didn't I, get I, much of a clap when he came I off. Don't I don't think, think it's about Yuri Tillemans. I think, I think today we just got the tactics wrong. I thought Madison again put, put wide into like the right wing position. He just doesn't work. Most creative player in, who gets put wide and he doesn't do anything to help. Um, you've got someone like Perez coming on on the 85th minute. If you want to be playing him, you might as well be starting him in that, that wing spot and then putting Madison central. And he just... And that, even the defence, I thought defence was quite slow. He just kept going round from one wing back to another wing back, back around. It just it looked boring. That's that's why we had all the possession. Nothing went forward, and we just didn't go for the middle. And it didn't help with the amount of fouls that they had. I think there was like 30 fouls in that game, and only three of our players got booked. So how how they got, didn't get booked, I don't know. Uh, it's about Roma, isn't it? Well, now it is really. Yeah. yeah. I thought a few games ago we probably could have still had a chance in getting somewhere close to top seven, but now with the last three games, it's got no chance. I think now it's definitely all about Roma. Um, now at least Vardy's well, back to at least try and get something against Roma now. Brilliant. Well, well, let's know in the comments what you think from a very windy Kimpa Stadium about Dakar, Yuri Tellemans.